So just to review again, I know we went through this in lecture last week, but I want to go over our grading rubric for our final project. So below is the rubric that we'll be using here. So this is what the grader is going to be using for what you turned in for your final report. Introduction, statement of need, your design, your design overview and statement, uh, your performance requirements, reliabilities, your safety requirements, the component overview material selection. Then a large portion here is going to be dedicated to that individual detail component analysis. This is the FEA for each of your five parts. Then we'll have a section on your cost requirements, industry standards and government regulations, your manufacturing requirements, sustainability requirements, then your conclusion, future work and feasibility references, and then a little bit of bonus if you guys went above and beyond at the grader's discretion. So again, this was the format for the write-up, so I'll still be expecting to see all of these things in your final presentation as well. Not in as much detail, but I do want you to discuss all of this information within your final video presentations. So for your final presentations, I'll have this rubric up in front of me, and I'll be grading through as you guys are presenting. So for the content within your presentation, it should be similar to what you have within the report that you turned in, not in as much detail, but you still do need to cover all of these areas within your presentation. So within this, I'm looking, do you have an introduction? Do you discuss your statement of need? Do you talk about the design overview? Do you talk about the performance, the component overview, component analysis, cost requirements, industry standards, manufacturing requirements, sustainability, conclusion, including your future work and feasibility, and your references. Now for each of these, I'll be grading this based upon novice, competent, proficient, or perfect. So within that, I'll be looking at the grading of these, and this is the grading breakdown for each of those right there. Novice, I'm concerned you just didn't even include it at all. Competent, you have a little bit there, but not much. Proficient, you barely met the minimum, and perfect, you included everything that we're looking for in that. So that'll be the first part of how I'm grading your presentations. The second part will be on your organization, your clarity, your creativity, the length of the presentation, do you stay within the limits, and the visuals. Is it appealing as we're going through? Do you have some good graphs? All of that stuff. So all of this is how I will be grading for a total of 210 points right there. And I'll add it up and you'll get a percentage for your final project presentation.